Hello, welcome to a new show on the Patch Channel, App Reviews with Mike, and I have today Mike. How you doing, Mike? I'm good. How are you, Joe? All pretty good. Okay, so it's App Reviews with Mike, so what are we going to cover on this show? Well, on this show we're going to be covering, well, apps on the Android devices like a tablet or a, I don't know, iPhone. Okay. So we're looking at the mobile platform apps, not so much PC games or Xbox and PlayStation games. We're, just, we're focusing on apps and mobile devices, correct? Correct. All right, so what's today's app we're going to cover? Today's app is Minecraft Pocket Edition. All right, so Minecraft Pocket Edition, I know it's a really popular game. I myself don't have a clue what you're talking about, <laughs> but I know there's a lot of people that play this game, and, I, and they really enjoy it. So the Pocket Edition, does that mean... I'm able to take what I play on a console and take it to the tablet. Is that what that covers? Well, Minecraft Pocket Edition, it is, well, they started over the Minecraft from the first update, put it on the uh, portable devices, mm -hmm. like, like I said, tablet or iPhone, stuff like that. And you can't take over what you did on the consoles like PC, Xbox, PlayStation 3, etc. Uh, but you can do basically the same thing except since it's still in like the the second update of the game mm -hmm. you can't really do much the worlds are extremely small still unlike the xbox and the pc and all that okay so the pocket edition just a scaled down version of what you're used to playing with then yeah okay all right so how much does this app cost it costs only seven dollars seven dollars for the app really yeah well Better than some of the other apps. Oh, yeah, I was going to say, it's a lot cheaper than going to the store and buying, you know, $60 video games. So buying this app for 7 bucks is a lot better, a lot easier on the wallet. Yes, it is. <laughs> okay, so you got your game, you got it downloaded, it's installed, ready to play. How do you play? What do you do? What's the main focus of the game? Well, it depends on what game mode you're on. There are two main game modes, and one of them has two branched off of it. The first mainly really popular game mode is creative mode. You get unlimited resources to do whatever you want with them. And then the other main game mode is survival mode. You don't have unlimited resources. You have to collect them by yourself using pickaxes, etc. And then you do whatever you want with them. Okay, so the creative mode, I can do whatever I want, create whatever words I want, but the other mode, I have to actually work for what I want to do. Yes, you okay, do. Okay, so which mode do you prefer? Well, it depends on what kind of mood I am. If I <laughs> want to create something that I want to play with my friends, creative mode. If I want to just go solo, survival mode. And the other two not as popular game modes that branch off of survival mode are adventure mode. That is survival mode, except you can't really break or place anything unless they are a light source or they are sort of glassy substance. Okay. And the other one is hardcore mode. It is survival mode, except you only have one life instead of unlimited, and it is on the hardest difficulty. Okay. So do you ever try to do the hardcore mode? Not yet. Not yet? I'm not that <laughs> You're not good. that brave? <laughs> no, not that good yet. Okay, so with this app, is there stuff that you purchase inside the app to play? Or once you buy the app, everything's there and you're, you're free to play? Once you buy the app, everything is there. You can do whatever you want with it uh, or not play it at all if you don't like it or get rid of the app. I don't know. Okay. All right, so on a scale of 1 to 10, 1 being the worst app you ever played, 10 being it's as good as gold, what do you recommend? I give it 9.5. Nine and a half. Nine and a half. It's not the best because, well, it's not exactly all I was hoping for being Minecraft. Mm -hmm. Still a really good game, though. So there's, there's, there's still some work they can do to improve it. Yes, there is. All right. Well, that's Mike's review this week of Minecraft. And stay tuned next week for our next app review with Mike. And this show is sponsored by A&M Digital Technologies.